Hi everybody, it's Cora from The Decorating Housewife. It's so good to see you again. I have another Dollarama haul for you from my car again. So if you're interested, stick around and I'll show you what I got. So guys, what do you think of my new sunglasses? I picked these up on Shein and uh, the reason why I got these is because I really like that 70s vintage vibe. I think that's such a cool look and uh, these sunglasses remind me of that and uh, they're very Gucci inspired so uh, very much on trend right now but I really like them and they only cost me like $11 and um, if you're interested if you look on Shein they're under um, geometric frame fashion glasses and I only picked them up for $11 so I think they're kind of cool. Tell me what you think. Okay, so here's my Dollarama haul. I wanted to get some kind of crayon or pencil crayon for uh, my Golden Girls coloring book. And I found these beautiful sets, these 18 colored pencils by Studio. And they come in uh, different shades of one color. So I got four packs. I'll show you what I mean. I got like this yellow kind of brown um, you know golden shade set and there's 18 pencils in here and um, it says they are premium quality soft point for optimal color transfer and there's 18 brilliant colors in here so I really really like these pencils they're very nice so I got it in this shade and then I picked it up in the kind of blue and purple and gray shade. Can you see that? And then in the pinks and peach and berry shades. And in the greens. These are just absolutely beautiful. And these were, uh, I believe, $4 each. So I picked these up so I can color in my uh, Golden Girls coloring book. And for my pencil crayons, I picked up this pencil sharpener by Studio. And this cost me $1.25. And uh, it's a double sharpener. And I got it in the color pink. There were other colors, but I kind of like this pink one. Hopefully it works well. So I picked that up. My Dollarama is always the last to get what everybody else got. So uh, just to let you know, I finally found the Royal Family Books. And I'll show you what I mean. I picked up uh, this one, HRH. I guess that stands for Her Royal Highness. So many thoughts on Royal Style by Elizabeth Holmes. And such a nice hardcover book. And uh, beautifully photographed. And uh, I guess it just basically talks about their style, their fashion, and uh, I really love their fashion. I love the royal family. Oh my goodness. I just love looking at them and following them. And uh, I, I feel so bad for uh, Kate Middleton right now and what she's going through. And I hope, I hope everything turns out well for her. Uh, she's so young and uh, so beautiful. And uh, like I said, I. I hope she gets well and um, stays that way. But this is the book I picked up and I really love this. And it's a great coffee table book. So, and uh, it says here, a nuanced look at the style and branding of the most influential members of the modern British royal family. And this cost me $5. So I'm glad I picked that up. And the next royal family book I picked up is called Behind the Crown, My Life Photographing the Royal Family by Arthur Edwards. And uh, you girls have this book, I'm sure. This cost me $5 as well. And it's a beautiful, nice hardcover book. And I just love looking at all the pictures. It's photographed so nicely. And uh, I'm so glad I found it finally. <laughs> so I'm definitely gonna, you know, sit down one night with a cup of coffee and just relax and just look at all the nice pictures. Such a nice book, nice quality. 
And then I saw Gemini Girl haul this beautiful wooden cheese board. I just love it and I had to pick it up. And I'm sure a lot of you girls pick this up too. This cost me $5 and it's by Rama Design and it says cutting board. And I just love it. What a beautiful, beautiful cheese board that is or charcuterie board. Isn't that beautiful? Sorry about the glare guys. And uh, I just love it. I can't wait to use it. And I might just get another one because I wanna get one for my son. Uh, he's on his own now, so um, I think this would come handy for him too because he has his friends over and it's great for cheese, crackers, uh, fruit, whatever you want really. Isn't that nice? It's nice and thick and uh, it doesn't have any measurements here, but I really love this. Okay, I'm sure you girls picked this up a long time ago. And like I said, my Dollarama is always the last store to get everything. Um, and I really like this little, this little guy. He's just so cute. Isn't that adorable? What a cute little bunny with these Harry Potter style glasses on, reading a book. Oh my God, he is so adorable. But I'm not going to put him outside. I'm going to keep him inside because if I leave it outside, it's just going to get ruined. So, and he's just too cute. Isn't that adorable? And they had an owl too with the glasses. So next time I go, maybe I'll pick that up too. And this cost me uh, $5. Just so cute. I needed to buy some more band-aids for my first aid kit at home. And so I picked up this Medicare adhesive bandages. Uh, these are latex free. They are the clear and there's 15 here and these cost me $1.25. So I got a pack of those to keep in my uh, first aid kit at home. I seem to run out of bat, uh, ba I was gonna say batteries. I, well, I run out of those too, but <laughs> I seem to run out of bandages for some reason. I don't know why, but <laughs> uh, I needed another pack, so I picked one up. I then picked up some deodorant and I buy the original Toms of Maine. And I like that it has a lot of the natural ingredients in here and there's no aluminum, no parabens. So I picked this up for, I think it's $3.50. Let me just double check on this receipt here. Uh, it says here, Tom's deodorant, $3.50. So it works well for me. So I picked that up. It's that time of year now where, you know, everything is starting to, um, you know, look like spring and I love feeding my birds. So I got this bird feeder for $5 and I think it's really nice. There's so many at Dollarama, but I just picked up this one. I think it's really nice. I'm going to hang it on one of my birch trees. I'm going to try to hang it as high as I can because I don't want the squirrels to get to the bird feeder like they always do. I mean, I don't mind feeding the squirrels too, but I feel like it's just so unfair to the birds. They just kind of hog all the seeds and <laughs> I feel so bad saying that. I love squirrels too, but you know, I want to try to hang it as high as I can and um, away from, you know, the fence as far as I can so that the birds can get to it first. And uh, yeah, so I picked this up. It's kind of like a coppery kind of look. And it's, you know, it's nice. It's a nice size. And with that, I got some uh, bird seed, of course. And um, the bird seed cost me wild bird food seed uh, cost me two dollars for this um for this bag here where is the size of this bag oh it's a one kilogram bag so i am still in the spring cleaning mode uh deep cleaning my home and i picked up some more cleaning products um, I saw these uh, Easy Erasers by Javex. There's four pieces in here for a $1.25. And that's what they look like. 
and uh, it says here that they uh, easily remove crayon, dirt, scuff marks, and soap scum. So I will be uh, using these to continue cleaning my home. I'm thinking of doing the baseboards, so I think these will be perfect for that, for that cleaning job. Lucky me. <laughs> and then I picked up these uh, Arm & Hammer wipes, and these are 21 by 11 inches. They're machine washable, I didn't know that. They're super absorbent, and there's six pieces in here for $1.50. So I got those. And I picked up some uh, Fabuloso. This is a multi-purpose -pur cleaner and it has long lasting freshness and it's in the lavender scent, which I love the scent of lavender. And this is 1.65 liters. And I believe this cost me $4, but I will double check. Fabuloso, I think it also comes in the lemon scent. And I would have preferred the lemon scent because I love the smell of lemons, but they only had this one in the lavender. So I picked that up. It's just as nice. And I use this to clean almost everything. It smells so good. And it did cost me, um, let me see here. I think it was $4. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Cleaner, $4. I also picked up some Dawn dishwashing liquid, and this is the Dawn Ultra Oxy Plus Oxy Superior Stain Fighting Power in the Lemon Scent, which I love. And it's 431 mil size. And I believe this was $3. But this Dawn is great. I mean, you can clean almost anything in your home with this. Uh, it's very strong. It's it does its job. It really does. I've cleaned my stove with this. I've cleaned my counters. I've cleaned my walls. It's it's really a good dishwashing liquid to, to have in your home. And this is this was uh, three dollars. Yes, three dollars. And of course, to clean uh, all my toilets, I needed to pick up some Lysol. And this is the Lysol Toilet Bowl Cleaner. It says it kills 99.9% .9 of bacteria. And it is 473 mil size. And it has 10 times the cleaning power. So I picked this up. And I believe this was $2.75. Let me just double check. And it says here, yes, Lysol Action Gel, 275 so I picked that up to clean all the toilets. How fun is that? Well guys, that's all I have for you today. I hope you enjoyed my Dollarama haul and uh, leave me a comment and tell me what you think of my new sunglasses and uh, be honest, I, I can take anything. <laughs> it's not everybody's kind of style, I know, but I think they're pretty cool. And you know what? They also came with a case. How nice is that? A nice case too for eleven dollars can't go wrong for trendy things you know what i mean anyways i hope everyone has a great day and i'll see you next time bye for now